Hey, what's going on you guys? It's your boy Swipe Boom here with another mukbang video. What's going on? How are ya? For shout outs, requests, and dedications, please go ahead and hit us up on uh, our most active social media platform, which is Love at First by Vlog. Once again, that's Love at First by Vlog. I try to stay consistent on there and my personal Instagram. And my wife also tries to stay uh, consistent on hers uh, by showing you guys what we eat what we're doing to work out on our weight loss journey as I eat this beautiful plethora of Chinese food. Um, you know, pictures of what we do, what we shop, what we, you know, where we work out, hiking and hanging out with our puppy and things like that. And we've been loving all the love and comments that you guys have been giving us on our, on our Love Efforts by Vlog. So if you guys are interested in going down there, if you haven't followed us yet on Instagram, please, please, please go follow us. On that one in particular, you can follow us on anyone you want, really. We have everything. Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, uh, all the platforms. But our most active one is going to be Love at First Bite Vlog on Instagram. And Cold as Water Hookup. If you guys want your old, your this is a 64-ounce bottle. But if you guys want your own hookup on that one or the smaller one, which is a 21-ounce, I believe. Um, hit that link down below in the description box. Uh, type in promo code BOOM. And uh, get yourself a little hookup. It's kind of like a Yeti or Orca, Orca um, water bottle. It uh, keeps your water cold and your hot coffee hot and all that good mess. You know, I always talk about this and I carry this everywhere I go. I like it when people ask us in public, what's up with that coldest water? I see a lot of YouTubers. Are you a YouTuber? Nobody's ever said that. I'm just kidding. But, you know, hit the link. <laughs> cold as water. Uh, I want to just, before I go in, I know it's like two minutes already and you want me to eat. Uh, this was going to be originally a, uh, ASMR, but there's so much noise going on around my apartment complex that I just decided to do a mukbang. Um, I want to thank everybody for the live stream yesterday. Uh, I usually don't like doing live streams just because I feel like it's very lazy of me to do them. Um, when I'm not in the mood to tag into this and to that, I just do a live stream real quick. Um... But it actually was one of the best, one of the, I don't know if it was the best, but one of the better live streams I've ever done in the five years that I've been. It was just, you know what it was? It was like a good, inter I had my laptop right here and it was a good interaction between viewers, people that have followed us for a long time, new people, trolls, uh, and a few YouTubers that show me love all the time too, so... It was just really fun and a lot of nonsense, a lot of joking around, a lot of some serious dialogue and some not. And it was just, I don't know, I just had a really good time. And that particular live stream I did last night with uh, Popeye's chicken, uh, which was also delicious, kind of, it, it's kind of inspiring me to do more live streams. And I kind of understand why other people do so many live streams. So. Uh, I'm going to start getting into that more and more often and uh, showing you guys a little bit more of my mediocre life. Anyways, I'm starving. Um, this intermittent fasting crap, it's literally 4 o'clock in the afternoon and I have not eaten one thing. I thank you for everybody voting on what you wanted me to eat today. It was between this and Chipotle. I haven't done a Chipotle video in a very, very, very long time. Um, but Chinese food has won. I haven't done a Chinese food video in a long time either. So spring roll, egg roll, pork fried rice, general sauce chicken. Actually, that's, that's egg fried rice. General sauce chicken, honey chicken or orange chicken, lo mein, uh, these little sugar bread things. Uh, you know, it's very authentic Chinese food, straight from the country of China. Uh, this is a uh, chicken on a stick. Another egg roll, um, General Tso's chicken. No, General Tso's, wait, is this? Sweet and sour chicken. These little crunchy things. And of course, my favorite is fried rangoon slash wonton slash whatever. Oh, thumbnail time? Okay. Thumbnail time. Let me get this in here like that. Okay. Yeah. Okay. There we go. And then super in there. And then. Perfect. Let's get into it. 
Mm. Yo, these fried wontons. Crap. It's basically crab with cream cheese. Mmm. Mmm. I like to put on my rice and my lo mein, sriracha, and duck sauce. I don't know why. Oh, and soy sauce, too. Maybe this could be another thumbnail. This place isn't. This is. You know, this place isn't even that good. That is. Just, I haven't eaten. Everything is so much more delicious when you just starve yourself. You know. Mmm. Another thumbnail? I don't know which one now. Now, let's go with the first one. Mmm. Let's open this up. Oh, that's not a good sign. No fortune. I guess I got everything I already want. What about this one? Okay, this one now. Oh no. Check an item off your to-do list. Prove you can follow through. Um, okay. I don't know what to talk about, y'all. I was on my way to the gym and um trying to oh shit trying to figure out what to eat for y'all aka for me that I looked at one of my old videos where everybody was suggesting what to watch on Hulu and Netflix and everything. And the one thing everybody's bugging out about right now is Game of Thrones. 
and I suck at Game of Thrones because the few times I watched it and I got into it, it was awesome. But I've never watched it from the beginning. Mmm. There's honey chicken though. I picked up a piece when I grabbed the domain. How long has that show been on? Five years? Six years? And the thing is, I need to watch it from the get-go. I need to watch it from the very beginning. Because I watched <laughs> like season four or something. It was awesome. And I did not watch the ladies episode of Game of Thrones. But you know YouTube they be taking clips, uploading it. I saw when the, you know, you know, all the people in the city, no spoiler alert. Maybe I'm making that up. I was just kidding. <laughs> I don't get butt hurt when People say the endings of things. I don't, it doesn't matter to me. It's very rare where I'm like, I don't get it twisted. I was very excited for um, Endgame, but I wasn't going to lose my shit if somebody was like, so and so, blah, 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 and so and so, you know? I, I wouldn't, I still would be excited to go see it. But, um, yeah, I need to watch Game of Thrones from the very beginning because I've watched a few episodes and it's just like when I saw that scene on YouTube from the most recent episode of Game of Thrones, it looked hella sick. I was like, yo, what is going on? What is going on? And then the episode before that, I watched the clips from that too. It's kind of like, when, this, when the show Sopranos was out, or The Wire, I never watched it. I had HBO, I never watched it. Let's try this sugar bun thing. Mm. And then I watched The Wire and Sopranos later. No. The Wire? No. If you haven't seen The Wire, let me tell you something. Captain America dies. <laughs> It's crazy how your mood changes. You know what I need? I need, if anybody is a diehard Game of Thrones fan, I need a link to like a breakdown video on YouTube. Like I'm talking about like not just the storyline, like, I need to understand, like, 
I need to see a map of their world. Because I know it's not Earth. It's Earth. But it's not. But it's not our continents. It's not even Middle Earth. It's like a different, it's a story of a different, I don't know, okay? I need to see the land, where each kingdom is, who runs that shit from the beginning to the end. And remember who I am, okay? Don't be sending me no like, here's a 45 minute video on Game of Now. No, just give me, get, I'm an old dumb man. Just give me, whoa, wow, that sucks. Is all, uh, <laughs> just give me like a good video that will break it down to me easily, all right? Keep my attention span going, okay? Please. Because I want to watch Game of Thrones from the beginning. But do I? I feel like it's a lot of time and effort. I, I feel like I've talked about Game of Thrones before. And... I feel like I've said this. I'm not into Middle Earth shit. That's why I never got into Lord of the Rings. I never got into anything that has to do with knights and castles and dragons and orcs, trolls and witches in the forest. And Somebody explained to me one time, it was like, the reason why folklore, European folklore, is such a big deal, is because, like on a serious note, why it's a big deal. Other than the fact that the stories are awesome, like Hansel and Gretel and all these like weird whatever. Um, along the times of like, all those crusade wars and all that, all that religious shit. Um, a lot of Europeans history got like just destroyed. So all they had is like word of mouth. And a lot of it turned into awesome storytelling between like, you know, things that just to tell your children, like don't walk into the forest at night because the witches will get you. And at first it became like, just like stories for kids. And then it became this huge thing. Like, you could literally look up European folklore. And they, like, worship gods. Like, even, like, Loki. Not from the Mar not from Marvel. Like, the original Loki. God of mischief. All that crap. That's, like, real European folklore. Then it turned into story tales about Middle Earth. Knights, dragons, fighting monsters, witches. Fucking all that shit, right? So... I've just never been into it, but good stuff is good stuff. Kind of like, I don't like country music, but the more I live in Alabama and the more newer shit I hear or old shit, the more like good music is good music. I just, I started getting into a little bit of country. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> Game of Thrones is one of the first things and a couple Lord of the Ring movies. It's like the first time I've ever been into like that type of shit. So, good storytelling is just that. Simple as that. Good storytelling. So, if anybody can give me the bullet points on Game of Thrones or a link or something, I would like to get into it. Or give me your password to your thing thing so I can stream it for free from, you know. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I feel great now today. Thank you so much for having lunch with me. I always appreciate y'all coming through, saying what up. Thumbs up the video if you like it. Thumbs down if you don't. Comment, subscribe, and we will see y'all on the next video. All right, y'all. Peace. See if I can reach over here.